Hi there, my name is Sam. I'm one of the co-founders of Movement. In this video, I'm gonna walk you through the basics of using Movement to deliver and sell your content in your own app. And after watching this video, you're gonna have a good understanding of the Movement Builder, how to create and edit content, and also how to make money from your app. So if you're ready, let's jump in. So here we are in the Movement Builder. I've used the beauty template here, but the concepts I'll go through apply whether you've used a template or not. I want to adapt this to sell a course on starting an online business. So let's get started doing that. The movement builder is designed to be simple and intuitive with an emphasis on what you see is what you get. So to edit something, you just need to click it. You'll notice that as we click, you'll start to see more of the structure of the page. These are what we call blocks and they give you a lot of customization ability. We have another video that goes into more detail on the builder and the blocks. And for now, we'll stay focused on updating this course. So we're gonna click into our content block and then onto the course that we want to edit. So as I mentioned, I'm going to customize this into a course focused on teaching my members how to start an online business. So let's call it starting an online business. Next, I wanna update the imagery here into something that's more representative of my course. And doing so is easy with our built-in Unsplash and Pixels integrations. So again, I'll simply click on the image, click replace image, and then up here you can see Unsplash and Pixels. I'm going to search for some imagery, online business. I like the look of this one, so let's use that. And done. I have a new image. Next, let's quickly move on to the content of the course, the lessons. Over here on the left, you'll see what we call the page tree. And you can think of it like a folder structure where you can group the content of your course however you would like, such as modules or weeks. For now, I'm just gonna use a simple structure of lesson one, two, and three. So let's jump into lesson one. Again, I wanna update the title here, so I'm just gonna click here and call this identifying online business ideas. And to swap out this video, all I need to do is click it, replace video, and here I'm gonna see that YouTube and Vimeo integrations where all I need to do is paste a link to add a YouTube video or Vimeo video to your video library or you can always just drag and drop to upload your own videos. Now to create lesson two the easiest way is to simply go over here and click duplicate. I'll give it a title of lesson two and now I have lesson two created from lesson one. Now if you don't like the look of this or you want something slightly different you can always create one from scratch or you can pick from our expertly designed templates using our template library i like the look of this one click choose this template and then i'm going to call this lesson three nice now that i have my core structure i want to set it for sale Doing so on movement is super easy. Simply navigate back to your, the homepage of your course and select access. Access rules in movement are very flexible and support a wide range of use cases such as tiered subscriptions, bundled offers, and much more. We have another video going into more detail on access, but for now, we're just going to override access for this course so that it's only available to members that have purchased it. Next, we'll add a product. In movement, products are the things that you sell. They can either be recurring or one-off. For recurring products, you can set intervals such as daily, weekly, every six months, or a custom interval. You can also set free trials and change the currency. For this course, I'm just gonna set it to one-off though, $49. Simply type in 49 and create my product. Now you can see that my product has been associated with this page and that members will be asked to purchase the product before starting the course. So next, let's have a look at what this is gonna look like for our members. And to do so, we click this preview button up here. 
Here is a live preview of your app and exactly what your members are going to see. You can see that if I come down here and click purchase, it's going to prompt the checkout, which is integrated with Apple Pay and Google Pay for seamless checkout. But this is what your members are going to see. If I make further updates, I can save and publish and my changes are live immediately. If I was on my phone, I would just need to pull down to refresh. So now I'm pretty happy with my course. So let's exit out of here and make a few small tweaks to the home page. So this is still saying beauty from the template. I can update this to business. I can come down here and say ready to launch your business. Maybe I'll come back to this and add some quick tutorials on business. Maybe I don't want this section. I can just click delete or you can click backspace on your keyboard. I might want to change the image here. I can do so by clicking this uh, add media and then dragging and dropping my images onto um, the page and always edit the text. So in summary, in just a few minutes, we've set up our new app with a course that's ready to be sold with an integrated checkout, progress history, push notifications, and much more. And we're only just scratching the surface of what you can do with movement. Please let me know below if you have any questions and check out our other videos that go into more depth on some of the topics we've demonstrated. See you in the next one. Thanks.